Hey guys, what's going on? Trevor Knife here. Um, so, okay, so I did something today by accident, and after that it became like an on purpose thing. So, I freaking accidentally hit, like, I, I don't, I don't consider it a semi, I don't know what it is, it's like, it's like a, one of those trucks that holds other cars. Um, I hit one of those. And so I told my dad that, like, is he home? Move, Rex, move. Is he home? No. Okay. But anyway, guys, I, I told my dad that a guy hit me and ran off. I did the wrong. I was the one that hit the thing and left. So my dad's mad because I lied. But he did, he, like, no question, am I okay? Is things, is things good? He worried about the fact that I lied to him. He didn't even, like, think, oh, well, at least he's safe. That's all that matters. I didn't even get a response. I didn't get a response like that, guys. So, my dad's going to come home. He's going to yell at me, and then he's going to be like, oh, you need to learn how to be a man. I need to be a man. Dude, I already know how to be a man. It's just, I did one little thing. I had to lie because I was afraid to get a reaction. And that's the first thing everyone, anyone's going to do. Th that's the first thing everyone's going to do to the parents. They're going to lie and be like, yeah, I, 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 I was afraid to get your reaction. So now I'm just kind of like waiting. I have to work today at 5. So I'll be gone until 10.30. They'll be in bed. And I don't know what time my, my dad's coming home. But I'm going to get yelled at out of the way. And I'm going to get in trouble. And so I talked to my mom about it. My mom was trying to be supportive and stuff. She was like trying to be like, it's okay. Just calm down. Things will be good. There's no need to worry. Maybe the, maybe the guy might not press charges. And I'm guessing he didn't press charges because nothing was said. So, um, and this was in a private Area. Is it was that Circle K? Um, it wasn't. There's no gas station. It was just like the store Circle K. Um, so it was a private property, and the guy. I don't even know if they could press charges or not, but I don't know. But the the guy was the guy. The guy that I hit was gone. I didn't hit a guy. Hit the, the the vehicle was gone, and all that stuff. My dad didn't even tell me that the freaking cops and stuff were gone. They, he didn't even tell me what happened. And I literally had to go through the whole school just to look through that across the street for a second, okay, to see if they're there. No one was there. I didn't get a text back or nothing. So, I don't know. I, like, I told my mom, and I told my dad that I told my mom, and my dad got really pissed off. So, after that, he got mad at me for telling my mom. But the thing is, my mom is my mom. She is allowed to know this information. Now, I had to... Now, I, I did apologize for lying. I did apologize. And I think he did take that into consideration because he probably would have done the same thing to stay out of trouble. But I don't know. So I'm just hoping whatever happens, happens. I might lose my stuff, my computer, so I might not have any recordings. I'm going to try to do vlogs and stuff. If I lose my computer, if not, if I don't lose my computer, then shit, I'm still doing my, my, my videos. Uh, live streams have to be canceled and stuff like that. When your parents tell you to never lie, listen to them, don't lie. My mom, she didn't like the fact that I lied either, but she knew, like, she, as, as long as she knew I was okay, then she didn't worry about it. She said, well, I would have ground you if you did something else to lie, but you, you could have been hurt. So I was like, exactly. My dad, even, my dad was just focused on me lying, and now I'm going to get in trouble for it. I tried to apologize, and he said it was okay. Like, it was, it's all good and stuff, but I got to pay for what happened to my Jeep. So... Because I'm 18, I gotta be responsible. And he and my dad, I don't, I don't know if I mentioned this, I think I did, but he said, I gotta be a man, I gotta learn how to be a man, and he's gonna teach me how to be a man. Um, I am a man. See this beard? I'm shaving it off because November is pretty much done. But I am a man, and I, I do what I do. And he thinks that, and he thinks I'm addicted to video games. I'm not addicted, it's just one of my favorite hobbies that I like to do. I hardly play because I got school and work, so I hardly ever play anymore. I don't know, guys. So much bullcaps going around. I don't know what to do. I I don't know, like, if I should panic. I don't know if I should, like... I'm just hoping that he's going to talk to me about it and then not even do anything. If anything, he'll just probably be like, you made a stupid mistake. I can't believe you did that. I uh, can't believe you lied to me. You got to be more careful and stuff like that. Like, I get it. He's trying to help me out, but he has a... He has a problem where he gets mad at ease, like, very easily. And, like, what I think it has to do with, like, I think it has to do with, like, your stress level. It gets higher, and that's what causes you to get angry faster. 
And that's what I think his, his thing is. So, yeah, I'm just hoping something changes. Because I'm worried, guys. I'm worried. But I'm going to be waiting. So, if he does not get home before work, great. That means I don't have to, like, worry about it. But I have to talk to him tomorrow because I'm off work. But, no. All right, guys. I'm going to go because I don't want this video to be too long. Uh, if you guys like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Also, subscribe to Gamers Plays and so forth. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Later, guys.